Hey, I'm Donovan, Family Programs Director at the YMCA of the Rockies Estes Park Center. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make bird feeders using recycled materials. So for this project, you're going to need a bottle, you're going to need some twine, um, you're going to need two short twigs or uh, small pieces of dowel rod, and then you're going to need a few supplies. You're going to need a push pin, and you're going to need a pair of scissors as well. Um, let's go over to the table and we'll try it out. First, we are going to add perches for the birds to land on. Using the push pin, poke two holes on opposite sides at the bottom of the bottle. Then, use the scissors to widen the hole until it is slightly smaller than your twig or dowel rod. Push your dowel rod through both holes so that it sticks out evenly on both sides. Next, add a second set of holes, roughly 4 inches above the first, and perpendicular to your first perch. Push your second dowel rod through this set of holes. Create two sets of holes for the bird seed, one and three inches above each perch. Widen the holes until they are just large enough for the birds to remove the seeds, but not so big that the seeds flow out freely. Using the push pin, poke holes in the bottom of your bottle to allow any water to drain out. Finally, add holes at the top of your bottle for the string. Before taking your feeder outside, Add seeds by using a funnel or a baggie with a hole snipped in the corner. Hang your feeder from a branch in a tree, far enough to be out of reach of any squirrels or, in this part of Colorado, any bears that happen to be passing. 